So today is the first day where we're introducing the paper man for Paul's letters. And this is an idea we got a couple weeks ago, introducing um, Paul's flashbacks. What I'm seeing so far with these man puppets, it's gonna be amazing personifying these individuals. Not looking at a human, but being able to see characteristics through an object. I, it's surprisingly powerful. I mean, you know, when you're looking at you know, butcher paper that's shaped like a person, like if you wouldn't think you might feel something when you watch that, but it's uh, it's just something that you would never expect. I love how the cast has been able to make these puppets come alive. They communicate with each other in their group. They're accepting these as humans and making them into personalities. It's incredible watching them develop. This is Renee. This is one of our cast members in Paul's letters. I'm gonna come down here. <laughs> there you go. Paperman puppets. This is your first day yeah. um, being exposed to them, even. Yeah. What, what's your initial reaction? I think it's a super cool idea. Um, when you first started talking about it, I was like, okay, okay, this could work. But when you finally get to see it come to life, and when people execute the moves, you think it's real. You're looking at a person almost, and I think that's really cool. And I think the ideas that we have with it. We are pretty spoiled with our team, aren't we? Oh, completely. Yeah. <laughs> we have the best. We for do. Sure. We really do. This is Nick. You know Nick. He's been with me forever. They look. It's like watching a child. You know, uh, a kid. You know, like a little kid who's just learning how to walk, and movements are a little twitchy and uncoordinated. It's kind of what it's looking like right now, mm -hmm. which is really cool because it still looks alive. So you're all learning to walk right now. Yeah. More from Paul's letters coming up. Others enjoy playing the piano and going over their vocal parts.